Hello everyone, welcome back to Pavli. Today in this video, we are going to see how to create mail modo contacts on FlexiFunnels form submission. So here my objective is that whenever a new form will be submitted in FlexiFunnels, then automatically a contact should be created in mail modo. And for that, I'm simply going to create a connection between FlexiFunnels and mail modo with the help of Pavli Connect. Pavli Connect works on two principles. First is trigger and second is action. Here my trigger application is Flexi Funnels and my action application is Mail Modo. To learn how to do this, let me take you to my screen. In this video, we are going to see how to create Mail Modo contacts on Flexi Funnels form submission automatically. And for that, we are going to use Public Connect, which will help us to automate this entire process. So as you can see over here that this is the landing page of this software and to directly reach out to this landing page, you can search for www.pabli.com slash connect. And now as you can see on my right hand side that there are two options, sign in and sign up free. If you are an existing user, then simply click on sign in. But if you are a new user, then please click on this tab sign up free. It won't take more than two minutes. And yes, you will also get 100 free tasks every month. So I'm simply going to click on sign in as I'm an existing user. And here we have reached all Pabli application page. Now let's click on access now for Pabli Connect. And here we have reached the dashboard of this application. And if you want to create a new folder, then simply click on this plus icon over here and create a new folder. And again on my right hand side, you can see a tab named as create workflow. Let's click on this. And here a dialog box has appeared, which is asking us to name the workflow. So I'm going to name my workflow as create mail motor contacts on flexi funnels form submission. So as you can see over here that we have to select a folder. And for that, I'm going to click on this drop down over here. And here you will find all the folders which you have created earlier. Now I'm simply going to select flexi funnels to mail modo. And after that, I'm going to click on create. And as we do that, here we have reached another window, which has got us to extremely important events. First is trigger and second is action. Trigger is when this happens and action is do this. Basically, action here is the response of your trigger application. Now, my trigger application is going to be Flexi Funnel. Let's click on this. And here we have to select a trigger event. This is the event which will make your workflow start. Let's click on this. And here you will find two options. New form submission and new purchase. I'm simply going to select new form submission. And it says triggers when a form submission is received. Let's select this. And now as you can see that we have received a webhook URL over here, which will act as a bridge between FlexiFunnels account and our Pabli Connect account. And also this webhook URL will help us to connect FlexiFunnels with Pabli Connect. And given below here are the steps to set up this webhook URL. So firstly, I'm going to copy this webhook URL from here. And after that, let me take you to my FlexiFunnels account. So as you can see over here, we are on the projects page and this is the project which I'm going to select. And now I'm simply going to click on project settings over here. And after that, here we have to select a page and my page name is PC integration. So I'm going to click on this. So this is my page and I'm going to click on edit page over here. And as you can see over here that this is the form which I've created. Now I'm going to click on this and after that, I'm going to click on settings. And here in style settings, I'm going to click on settings. And after that, here in advanced settings, you will find connect here. I'm going to click on this. And after that, I'm going to click on webhook. And here in webhook, we have to paste the webhook URL, which we have received through public connect account. And we have to give our webhook a name. So I'm going to name the webhook as testing. And after that, I'm going to paste the webhook URL, which we have received through public connect. And now I'm going to click on save. And we have successfully built a connection between Flexi Funnels and Pabli Connect. So now I'm going to click on save over here as well. And after that, I'm going to click on publish. And we have successfully published this page. Now let's go back to our Pabli Connect account. And as you can see over here that it says waiting for webhook response. And there is a note. Now log in to the application where you have added the webhook URL and do a test submission or record so that the data can be recorded here in the webhook response. 
So let me take you to my Flexi Funnels account again. And after that, I'm going to click on Actions. And here in Actions, I'm going to click on Published URL. So as you can see over here that this is the form which I've created. Now I'm simply going to enter all the dummy details over here to do a test submission. And I have successfully entered all the dummy details over here to do a test submission. And the first name is current, the last name is lead, the email address is currently at the rate and the phone number is this. Now I'm simply going to click on submit over here and we have successfully submitted our form. Now let's go back to our public connect account and check whether we have received a response or not. And as you can see over here that we have successfully received a response. The first name is Karan. The last name is Lead. The email address is currentlead at the rate which means we have successfully set up our trigger application. Now my action application is going to be mail modo. Let's click on this. And now here we have to select an action event. Let's click on this. And here you will find three options. Trigger campaign, add contact to list and custom API request. I'm simply going to select add contact to list. As my objective is to add a contact in mail modo on FlexiFunnels form submission. And now I'm going to click on connect. And now to connect our mail modo account with our public connect account, we need to set up a connection. For that, I'm simply going to select add new connection. But if you have an existing connection, please select existing connection. Now to add a new connection, here we have to enter the API key. And given below here are the instructions to find this API key. So now to enter this API key over here, let me take you to my mail modo account. And here in mail modo account, I'm going to click on settings. And after that, here in settings, you will find API keys. And here I'm going to add an API key by clicking on this tab over here. And here we have to name our API key. So I have named my API key as dummy key. Now I'm going to click on OK. And we have successfully added an API key over here. So I'm going to click on show API key. And after that, I'm going to copy this API key from here. And then I'm going to paste it over here in my public connect account. So as I have entered the required details to add a new connection, now I'm going to click on save. And we have successfully connected our mail modo account with our public connect. So now let's move ahead. Here we have to enter the email address which is required. And for that I'm going to use a method called as mapping. Basically mapping means to insert the data from the previous steps. So I'm going to map the email from the previous response which we have received through Flexi Funnels, and the email address is currently at the rate pablitudes.com. So here we have to enter the list name. So let's go to mail modo and here in mail modo you will find segments and lists. I have created these three lists over here which is connect pab new contacts and my emails. So I'm going to select new contact list from here and after that I have entered the list name over here in my public connect account. And now we have to enter personalization fields for example like this. So as you can see over here that I have entered personalization fields as first name, last name, phone in double apostrophe over here. And I have also mapped the first name of the user from the previous response which is current and the last name is lead. After that I have entered the phone number which is this. And now I am going to click on save and send test request. And as you can see that we have received a positive response and the message says contact is successfully created and added to the list. So let's go to mail modo account and check whether we have created a contact or not. Now I'm going to refresh this page once. So as you can see over here that we have successfully created a contact named as current lead and the email address is current lead at the rate pablitudes.com which means we have successfully connected FlexiFunnels account with mail modo with the help of Pabli Connect. And now to check this automation in real time, I'm going to fill out this form again. So I have entered all the details over here. So the first name is smart, the last name is lead, the email address is smartlead at the rate pablitudes.com and this is the phone number. Now I'm simply going to click on submit and we have successfully submitted our form and now let's go to our mail modo account and check whether we have added a contact or not. So as you can see over here that we have successfully added another new contact named as smart lead and the email address is smart lead at the rate pablitudes.com. Now let's go back to our public connect account. So as we have successfully set up our trigger in action applications and it was a successful workflow. So let's summarize this quickly. 
Here my trigger application is Flexi Funnels and my trigger event is New Form Submission. Here my action application is Mail Modo and my action event is Add Contact to List. And if you also want to create Mail Modo contacts on Flexi Funnels Form Submission, then simply follow this workflow step by step. Hope this video was a helpful one. Thanks for watching. Not only these applications, but you can integrate many other applications with the help of Pabli Connect. If you have any doubt, then you can reach out to us at support at the rate pabli.com. If you want to ask any query, then you can reach out to us at forum.pabli.com. If you want to ask any pricing related issue, then you can directly reach out to us at this website. And if you find this video helpful in any way, then do not forget to share it with your friends. And please subscribe to our channel to learn more such automations.